Uh, back in Mass Effect 3 on the tram station. Flora and Caden about to meet the doctor. The nice doctor. That's gonna heal. Caden Stutter. Right. Caden. Shepherd Elusive man Fascinating race, the Protheans They left all this for us to discover but we squandered it. The Alliance has known about the Archives for more than 30 years. And what have they done with it? What do you want? What I've always wanted. The data in these artifacts holds the key to solving the Reaper threat. I've seen your solution. Your people are turned into monsters. Hardly. They're being improved. Improved? That's what separates us, Shepard. Where you see a means to destroy, I see a way to control, to dominate and harness the Reaper's power. Imagine how strong humanity would be if we controlled them. Earth is under siege and you're hatching a scheme to control the Reapers? You've always been short-sighted, hasty. Your destruction of the Collector base proved that. That base was an abomination. Hundreds of thousands of humans were murdered there. This isn't your fight any longer, Shepard. You can't defeat the Reapers, even with the Prothean data. I can use both. With. Work with me. Give me control of your resources and I'll stop them. You'd do better than most, but the odds aren't in your favor. More importantly, I don't want the Reapers destroyed. We can dominate them, use their power, harness their very essence to bring humanity to the apex of evolution. You've gone too far. The Reapers will kill us all if we don't stop fighting each other. I don't expect you to understand, Shepard, and I'm certainly not looking for your approval. You were a tool, an agent with a singular purpose, and despite our differences, you were relatively successful. But like the rest of the rebels in this place, your time is over. Enough talk. Liara? Don't interfere with my plan, Shepard. I won't warn you again. Duly noted. Shepard. What? The data, it's not here. It's being erased. Goodbye, Shepard. Damn it! How's he doing it? It's local. Someone's uploading the information. Hey! Step away from the console! Now! Ah! She's got the data. Nice spinning heel kick. Nice spinning heel kick. Did I get rid of my face cam? No, I did not. Damn you, Patrick. Ruining the cutscenes. Stay close. We can't lose her. Is that similarity? <laughs> yeah. Up the way, boy. Oh. Close the door on me. Bastard. Oh, wrong side. I need to open it. Damn you. <laughs> Damn you. I mean, she's just staying in there. Yep. What about now? There she is. Stay on her. There she she's goes. getting away. Watch out. That helped. So much. 
Oh, I'm shooting. Oh, nice one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, okay. Oh, this bad aim of that. Look at that. Oh, we got that. That's cool here. That's cool. Bad aim on this cool. The incinerate. I'm the better Byromensa. <laughs> oh. oh yeah. She's getting away. Damn it, James, Normandy, anybody? I got this one. Normandy's en route. They'll be here soon. We need the data. Let's burn her. Oh, that didn't do much. Okay. She died right. Grab that thing. Bring it with us. Shepard, we got Reaper signatures in orbit. King. Caden needs medical attention. We have to leave the soul system. I know. The Citadel is our best chance. We can find help there. Get us to the Citadel, Joker. Roger that. Hold on, Caden. See what you and Edie can learn from that thing. Commander, I'm receiving a signal over the secondary QEC. I believe it's Admiral Hackett. Patch me through. I'll forward it to the call room. Shepard, are you reading me? Commander. Edie, can you clear this up? I'll do my best. Did you get to the archives? I was there. So was the elusive man. I was worried Cerberus might try something. Did you get the data? Most of it. He downloaded some before I could stop him. Edie and Liara are analyzing what we recovered. What have you learned? Was it worth the effort? Preliminary evidence suggests the data is a blueprint for a Prothean device. Device? A weapon, massive in size and scope, that's capable of unquantifiable levels of destruction. 
Send me the data. We'll do our own analysis. If Liara's instincts are right, this might be the key to stopping the Reapers. I hope so. Major Elenko was critically injured. We're taking him to the Citadel. Sorry to hear that, Shepard. But we both know this is just the beginning. Talk to the Council, show them what you found. With luck, they'll give you all the support we need. And if they don't? Do whatever it takes to get them on board. I'll be in touch soon. Hack it out. Commander. Edie is extracting data from the Cerberus machine. We'll have details to present to the Council by the time we reach the Citadel. And Major Alenko? I've done what I can for him, but we need to get him to a medical facility soon. The Admiral's right. It's going to get worse, isn't it? Unless we stop the Reapers, yeah. I've looked at the data. This weapon could be the answer, if we can build it. I get the sense you don't quite believe it, though. You didn't see what they did to Earth. How is one weapon supposed to stop them? What are our options? You know we can't win this conventionally. Commander? Isn't it worth trying, at least? I'm gonna check on Caden and James. Make sure we're ready to present our findings to the Council. I'm sure the Council will see the need to help. It'll be a hell of a short war if they don't. What with checking on Caden and James, I mean, just Caden. I won't talk to James. It's not interesting enough. And we won't spar with, uh, with him. Not this time. Barely got a pulse here. Move him out. Where are you taking him? Where to Memorial. Best care in the Citadel. We're not going with? We need to see the Council. Right. Got to check it. Looks like cool. they might be coming to see you. Commander Shepard. Got word you were arriving. Captain Bailey. Good to see you again. Yeah, you too. Though it's Commander now. Congratulations. Uh, thanks. Now half my job is dealing with political bullshit and escorting dignitaries around. No offense. None taken. So you're here to bring us to the Council? I'm here to tell you the Council is expecting you, but they are dealing with their own problems with the war and everything. Uh, they apologize for the inconvenience and blah, 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 blah. Meet them here at Adina's office. They'll be ready soon enough. All right. You might have time to go by the medical center if you want to check on progress over there. Thanks. I might do that. You go on ahead. I'll head up to Adina's office. One of my men can show you the way. You? I'm just a tourist today. I'll try not to get in any trouble. Commander, we've got a situation in the embassy quarters. We could use your help. Hmm. I'll be right there. The other half of my job. I'll see you around, Shepard. No doubt. Recent intel suggests that the entire Batarian hegemony has been destroyed by an unknown force. I'll the round first. But you're on the Normandy, oh. right? I saw it dock. It was last seen on Earth. Oh, I might ignore you this time. She did, didn't she? I'll ignore quite a lot. 
Tell me that everybody on my ship. Swamp people, let's play. Too many people died already for that. It's an imperfect. Let's play. Yeah, the check it is cool. We are da. We are da. Hospital. Let's no see what we can find here. Oh yeah, our doctor. Shepherd, there you are. Dr. Chakwas, you're here? I'm working at an Alliance R&D lab down in Shelter Wards, coordinating closely with Admiral Hackett. I heard you escaped Earth in the Normandy and that someone was critically injured. I came as fast as I could. We had a run-in with a Cerberus synthetic on Mars. Caden took the worst of it. How is he doing? Very well, all things considered. I'm impressed with Major Elenko's resilience, as well as Dr. Michelle's expertise. I wish I could have been there to help on Mars. Your place is in Normandy's med bay, not some lab. I couldn't agree more. You say the word and I'm with you. The Normandy wouldn't be the same without you, Doctor. Get your things. Docking bay D-24. Yes, Commander. And thank you. Don't thank me so soon. Remember, Joker's still aboard. And I'd be surprised if he's been remembering his medication. The only crewmate who survived. Suicide run. Commander Shepard, good to see you. Dr. Michel, it's been a long time. You've come a long way from that small clinic down in the wards. Because of you, I don't know where I'd be if you hadn't dealt with Fist and his thugs. Now I'm med physician in a Presidium clinic. You gave me this chance. I assume you're here about Major Alenko. I barely remember her. How is Caden doing? The head trauma was severe, but we reduced the swelling quickly. These types of injury can go either way. He hasn't regained consciousness yet, but his vitals are strong, so I'm optimistic. You can go see him if you like. He's just down the hall. Uh, Keep up no. the good work, Doctor. You too, Much talking. This will be the last talking so, action. Let's play. No, I don't need the whiskey. Thank you for shopping. I was going more into detail in my previous let's play. We're not here for that. Patient stable for now. That's touch and go. Good work, Dr. Freya. Touch and go. I'll see if we have the required special bindings. Meet you back here. I'm having a little bit of a mask for tea, but mostly because there ain't too many good games coming out this year. And no, I will not play Bioware's Dragon Age The Bell God, that's the name. Yeah, oh, I don't Hi, play that. Didn't expect to see you again so soon. Definitely not. Looks like crap. Even though I don't want to see Bioware burn. And another Mass Effect. But I don't have high hopes for that anyways. Let's go in. Yeah, I'm that six pack. Hey, Caden. Don't know if you can hear me. But since you can't tell me to get the hell out either, I'm gonna take my chances. On your feet, soldier. <laughs> I love that, okay. Get your ass out of this bed and back to your post, Major. Seeing you in action again, reminding me you're a hell of a soldier. The Alliance could sure use you. I could use you. Sounds flirty. So French you soul, let's play. Let me know. Come on, Caden, fight. I will have to remind you, this is a French soul, let's that's play, Shepard. No flooding. That's why Jacob died. We're the flooding with him. And there is too. Did a male squad may survive? I believe one. I'm flirted with him. Anyways. Let's go meet the cancer. Because that always turns out in our favor. 
Presidium Embassy. That looks more empty than last time. Might have downloaded it more last time to make it more fuller. Oh yeah, no, we don't need that. We're not here for conversations. We're here for action. Bad. There is no anti-humanity conspiracy here, Ms. Al Jalani. The Council's simply not granting interviews at this time. My viewers are going to know that CSEC and the Council are denying them access. Listen, lady, you think I like playing gatekeeper between the paparazzi and the politicians? I don't have time to babysit them, and I'm not here to hold your hand. Well, I'm camping out until I'm granted an audience. Fine. I hope you brought a sleeping bag. Or the slumber. Commander Shepard? Commander, humanity has questions. Oh, you shut up. Damn press. See, so you're keeping the peace. Yeah, I feel like a glorified doorman. Most people would see it as a move up. Wedged in here with all the stuffed shirts? I'd rather be back down on the streets. I appreciate the higher pay grade, but I'm not a political creature. Don't lose your edge. You might need it. I oh, wouldn't mind an excuse to get my fingers dirty. <laughs> it's killing me about Earth. You and me both. I haven't been back in years. Now I may never. If this ain't the end of days, it's pretty damn close. It will be the end of days. It will be. Councilor Adina, please contact the Dorian Embassy. Please. Wake up. Please wake up. Commander, Councilor Odina said you'd be coming. If you'll follow me, the council is already in session. Oh, what are you gonna do? Council, Nothing, I bet. The are in our space as well. Earth is no more or less important than any council homeworld. But Earth was the first council world hit. By all reports, it faces the brunt of the attack. How do you know this is the brunt? New Reaper fronts are opening up everywhere. The reports are accurate. Earth was attacked. A full-scale invasion. And it's just the beginning. We need your help. Everything you can spare. Earth may be suffering, but our worlds are falling too. The Turians have lost Tatris. We must fight this enemy together. Need I remind you that the last time we fought the Reapers, Shepard sacrificed the Council to protect human interests. True, but in the end we survived because we followed Shepard's lead. And what if that's not enough this time? The reports are dire. If we throw everything we have at the Reapers on Earth and lose, what then? I don't expect you to follow me without a plan. Counselors, we have that plan. A blueprint created by the Protheans during their war with the Reapers. Prothean? What is it exactly? We're still piecing it together. But it appears to be a weapon of some sort. And this is capable of destroying the Reapers? So it would seem. It's immense and intricate. This is a fool's errand. The Protheans were wiped out by the Reapers. Clearly, the weapon is flawed. It was incomplete. There was a missing component, here. Something referred to only as the Catalyst. But they ran out of time before they could finish building it. Do you believe in this, Shepard? After what you've seen of the Reapers? Liara believes it can work, and so do I. And while I haven't always agreed with Udina, he's right about this. We need to stand together, now more than ever. The Reapers won't stop it, Earth. They'll destroy every organic being in the galaxy if we don't find a way to stop them. The Council cannot give Earth the military support it needs. Our own planets must come first. The Salarian Union is convening a summit amongst our species. If we can secure our own borders, we may be able to aid you. Our fleets are also engaged. Honesty is all I can offer, Commander. I will not make a promise of rescue that I cannot keep. Shepard, meet me in my office. I hope that's an offer of support. I'll be digging up what I can on this Prothean device, Shepard.
They're a bunch of self-concerned jackasses, Shepard. We may have a spot on the Council, but humanity will always be considered second-rate. How can they be so blind? Commander, I can't give you what you're asking for, but I can tell you how to get it. I'm listening. Palavin's Primarch Fedorian is the one that called the War Summit. He's your kind of man, open to extreme solutions. Trouble is, he didn't get out of Palavin's system when the Reapers attacked. We don't know if he's alive. He's essential to the summit. If the Normandy could extract him without being detected... You want me to rescue his ass in the hopes he considers helping Earth? Put bluntly, yes. I shouldn't even be telling you about it. But we need Fedorian alive, and your ship can get him. Save the Primarch, gain an ally. One with the power to grant you what you're looking for. Well, the Reapers ravage Earth. Your counselor was right. We need to work together. This is the best way to get that. <laughs> Our intel says Primarch Fedorian is on Palavin's largest moon. Get in and out undetected, and he'll take care of the rest. Good luck, Commander. You're gonna need it. There is one other thing. The Council has agreed to reinstate your Spectre status. And there are certain resources that will be made available to you. Good luck. Well, that went well. That's a it's a start. I'll talk to the others in the meantime. See if we can support this summit. Move things along. Thanks. Okay. Let's see if I can even buy one of those weapons. Probably too poor for it. But if this was a mod where you can down those prices, then I don't think I have it. Welcome, burn fleet. Spectrex. What? 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm super poor. Ah, uh, look, look. Oh, yeah. Really, we just need to get to Normandy. That's all we need to do. And then I uh, will see what's the next step. Javik side mission. Or the lift check. Commander Shepard. Commander, the people of the Alliance have questions. No. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment. No. No journalists. And at least, now at least, at docking bay D a minimum as possible of politicians. God. Theoretical and politicians. Uh... Or where or why. But you're on the Normandy, right? I saw it dock. It was last seen on Earth. Did Commander Shepard... No. Shut up. Uh, downloaded the Star Trek mod already. We should be safe, don't worry people. <laughs> I believe I already saw a big cut in the cutscene. Oh, that was quick. Okay. Ayara, can I help you? I've been forwarding the Turian Counselor information on the Prothean device. It can't be built without Council support, but he's not budging until their Primarch is safe. I know. Are you all right? Oh yeah, we need to go to the Turian Moon Palavan first for the missions. I didn't get what you'd call a good night's rest. There's more to it than that, isn't there? What's really bothering you? No. When the Reapers hit, I could hear people screaming in the streets below me. We left a lot of them behind. There's no way for you to save them all. 
But I know you're doing everything you can, and you'll get back there in time to help. I hope you're right. Don't blame yourself, Commander. Commander Shepard, I'm Specialist... Oh, uh, I, I beg your pardon. I thought you were alone. I was just leaving. No, uh... Commander Shepard, I'm Com Specialist Samantha Trainer with Alliance R&D. I was part of the team retrofitting the Normandy after you turned it over to the Alliance. There weren't many of us aboard when the Reapers hit. Slow down, Specialist Trainer. You're doing fine. Thank you. I worked in a lab. I never thought I'd be serving on a ship. Why don't you tell me about the retrofits? The ship's in line with Alliance regs now, and it has new, top-of-the-line, quantum entanglement communicators. In fact, Admiral Anderson had intended to use the Normandy as his mobile command center. That's no longer an option. Yes, I heard he chose to stay and fight. I in any event, I'm honored to serve under you, Commander. For as long as you need me, that is. They only sent me here to oversee the retrofits. Shepard, some of our systems require further testing, and Specialist Trainer has been extremely effective during installation. I would prefer that she remain. Got it, Edie. Oh, wait, since when does a virtual intelligence make requests? Edie's an AI. Fully self-aware. Oh, I knew it. I knew Joker was lying. Jeff requested that I pretend to be a simple VI to protect myself. I apologize for the deception. Thanks, E.D., and I apologize for all those times I talked about how... Mm, attractive your voice was. Anyway, shall I give you a tour? I think you'll be impressed by the new upgrades. In the CIC, you'll find the galaxy map where you can set the Normandy's destination. You can also check your messages at your private terminal. The War Room houses a strategic command center for mission-specific intel and war analysis. The shuttle bay contains an armory where you can modify your equipment between missions. Finally, Liara has set up a lot of hardware down in the old XO office on Deck 3. I think she's claimed that room. And there you are. Still the same ship as before, it just flies Alliance colors now. Speaking of which, I believe Admiral Hackett would like to speak to you at the VidCom. Of course he wants to. Uh, everybody, much talking. Commander, Udina updated me on your meeting with the Council. Sounds like they're running scared. The Council's been a pain in my ass from day one. I'm done with them. Then what's your plan? I'm trying to get the Turian Primarch for a summit meeting with the Asari and Salarians. I'll bypass the Council and appeal directly to their leadership. That's good, I like it. This is where we start laying the groundwork for our counterattack. Unfortunately, we don't have a whole lot to back it up right now. Then build alliances. Gather everything and everybody you can for the cause. What about the Prothean device? Find me people who can help build it, and if you can't, I'll take ships, soldiers, supplies, whatever you can get. We need to keep hitting the Reapers across every theater of war they open. Buy us time to figure out the device. And when it's finished? Assuming it ever is, we pool all our resources. Think of it as a giant armada for delivering the device, when the Reapers are most vulnerable. The stronger you can make that armada, the better the chances of punching through. What about Earth, sir? We'll just have to hope Anderson and what's left of the Alliance forces can hold out until we've dealt with the enemy. I understand. Good. Then make it happen, Commander. I'll be expecting regular updates on your progress. Hack it out. Boom, 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 boom. Earth, Arctus, Tetris. Was uh, seven, seven special forces? Sir Isaac Newton. Okay. Okay. Let's check out a few stages on the ship. Then the port is over. We're clearing ship music. Unbelievable. I can't believe the council won't help. Come on, Sarah. If Thessia was lost and Earth hasn't been found, the Alliance has found a new server. There it is. My fire team. 
Commander Shepard, Centurion Dacius Tarkas, leading the 39th Phantom Company Special Operations Squad. It's an honor to officially make your acquaintance. When Admiral Hackett reached out to Palavan Command requesting elite reinforcements, the hierarchy sent my unit without hesitation. With the Reaper invasion threatening all civilized life, it's in our mutual interest to combine strengths. My Phantoms have extensive experience fighting Merc bands, pirates, geth. Every major threat in recent decades. We'll integrate those proven tactics and technical skills into your crew. With your leadership, I know we can turn the tide against these monsters. You have the unquestioning service and loyalty of myself and Phantom Company. For the Hierarchy Alliance Council, for all peoples, we will defeat the Reapers. Now, how may we assist the Normandy crew in preparations? Um, that's cool. Um, that's cool. Even voice acted. Phantom Company fire team is now yours. They will now coming with you for different missions. We can customize the loadout using the terminal on the wall. On top of that, your fire team will also comment on your recent actions in the journey when you pass by. Acknowledge. Is it already built? Who are you? Oh, there's Heard the, the gist of what went down on Mars. Glad to see Dr. Tassoni safe after that Cerberus attack. Extracting a high-value target like that under heavy fire. Nicely done. The data she secured could turn the tide of this war. Oh, Though it came cool. at a cost with Caden wounded, wish him a speedy recovery when he wakes. In the meantime, we'll keep up the fight for both human and Turian worlds alike. Oh, that's cool. Very well then. Um, we'll um, deck. Not too many interesting people around. And alive. Let's talk to Liara. And Cluth. Where is he? No, he's here. I know he's here. There is. Greetings, Commander Shepard. Hmm. Huh. What are you? I'm Glyph, a VI assistant to Dr. Tassoni. I help her sort and catalog collected data. She's asked me to draw your attention to a terminal connected to her information network. It analyzes information packages. If you find any useful data, I can research upgrades for you. And what should I be looking for? I'll inform you if you found relevant data. When you do, return to this terminal for your choices. In the meantime, Dr. Tassoni would like to speak with you. Have a pleasant day. You know, I was hoping this new council would be more than the last one. The meeting okay. was less than ideal. Yeah, I'm shocked. At least the council can't deny the Reapers exist. But I'm not sure how much comfort that is while they bicker over which portion of the galaxy to save. Wow. Becoming the big info brokers turned you into a real cynic, Liara. I like it. I'm flattered. I think. Liara? What is all this stuff? After you left for Earth, I had the chance to track down the information trader who'd kidnapped my friend. It wasn't easy, but I found the Shadow Broker and took over his information network. You're running that from the Normandy? What oh. I can. Not all of the old Broker's networks remained intact, but I have agents. So you took over as the galaxy's most famous information trader? Notorious might be a better term. At least it means I can help research this Prothean device. It's far too dangerous to use until we understand it. I forgot that I didn't do that DLC and that. Let's play. I did it afterwards. Do the Protheans actually complete this weapon? You mean, will it work? They wouldn't have poured their last resources into this device if they thought otherwise. But we really need to find out just what kind of weapon they left us. It's, it's funny that she did that, becoming the Shadow Broker off screen without her help. Oh, good job, Liara. It'd be nice to know we're not kids playing around with a loaded gun. Absolutely. The damage it could cause if it backfired is unthinkable. People were finally starting to listen before the Reapers came. 
If we'd had a little more time, maybe Earth wouldn't. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to talk about it. The thought means a lot, Liara. Thanks. You're welcome. And since I didn't mention it before, it's good to be back, Shepard. Oh, I'm more tired. Okay, we got Liara here. This terminal got... contains non-essential correspondence from your allied forces. Doctor Tassoni. Hello again, <laughs> Shepard. Oh. How did you take out the old shadow broker? It cost me. I had to hire dozens of mercenaries just to storm his lair. <laughs> you really wanted him dead, huh? The broker captured a friend. I swore I'd get him back. And? I was too late to save him. Oh, really? It's the bad outcome, I guess. What happened when you became the broker? I made what use of the network I could, but my main base of operations was scuttled when Cerberus attacked. I saved whatever crucial hardware I could, but I'd rather not talk about it. The important thing is that I still have data feeds and agents, although the war's taking a toll on the latter. Oh, fuck, it's kind of unnecessary to make Haven and Broker if you don't help her. So is that drone your new secretary? Glyph is a VI shell that indexes my search functions on the data feeds. I couldn't work without it. Although I'm lucky Edie let Glyph on board after it tried to rewrite her scheduled tasks. I was merely attempting to standardize the ship's automated systems to our own, Dr. Tassoni. Yes, that's precisely why you're confined to the cabin. Oh, it's new. What have you been up to since we last saw each other? After the time I saw you on Ilium? Well, apart from becoming the broker, I spent my time looking for any defense against the Reapers. The only substantial records were the Protheans. I knew the elusive man was hunting for the same thing when our agents began crossing paths. Like on Mars. I thought I'd covered my tracks, but he had surveillance there all along. We'll talk later, Liara. Of course. Please, enjoy your day. No. I will not. Is there anybody on this stage that's interesting to talk to? I won't talk to anybody in engineering. Uh, let's look at Marmory, but I don't think that. Stood up. I won't need to spend much time here. Oh no, no thanks. Start weapon upgrades. So oh, yeah, right. Oh, nothing yet. Nothing yet. No. What? Okay. That's something I've never seen before. That's probably cheating. Ah, oh, that we can buy different weapons and inferno armor and stuff like that. Spectre requisitions, don't have the money. Morning stars. Oh, yeah. Um, that's very much the motor. We get dresses here, outfits. I will probably buy something. As soon as I ran out of everything else. But there's probably way too much to look through here again. Mirror dress, off shoulder stuff. So, so many outfits. But no armor. Seems like. Phasers. Yeah. Now uh, yeah, I will probably buy something if I run out of options. No Halloween costumes this time, what the hell? Oh. I never saw that before. Stereo control. Ha. Huh. Audio. Ooh. Okay. Let's switch outfits for the next part. Last thing we do. We have ship music now. Nice. What's that? Psych appearances. Oh, that's the armor. Those are the new armors for him. Let's go with that. And we are, uh, should have some new armors too. This one looks goofy. This one looks cool. And this one looks like she has a broken heart. I don't see that one too much. That one looks cool. That looks not this cool. This one. I want the last one. Let's start with the last one. 
This one's cool. Set. Crew manifest. The hell is that? Huh. You can make people officers. Does that have any marine officer? None. That's weird. That must be part of a mod. Sweet. Never seen that before back. Customize review as a spectra. The hell? Okay. Okay. What are you? The... No, I don't see what happened. Oh, I'm seven. Uh, let's go with him. No, not yet. Okay, let's piece something together then. So, time for cat armor. Kind of like the style of that. Well, something else shoulders. No. That was, looks less glitched. Nothing here. Button. No, no, let's keep it like that. Oh, oh, no more outfit. Let's start from all the way to the back and go prove it. No, yes, sure. No buttons, no buttons. Not in my let's play. I refuse. It's a button that's let's play. Oh, yeah, choker, choker. Last Come person. On, you've got a new message at your private terminal. There, that would go through the lighter. 18 or 25. I'll probably start uploading and working hey, out. Hey, Commander. You know, I had my doubts about the Council. But after years of ignoring your warnings, they're finally willing to step up and tell you they just can't help. Ugh. They've spent years denying the threat. You think they'd be prepared now? I was kind of hoping that maybe they were planning in secret and just not telling you about it because, you know, Cerberus. Well, let me know if you want me to get them on the channel and then hang up on them, you know, for old time's sake. Okay. Ah, we can do that. Sounds fun. Now we're finally done.